tens of thousands of computers infected by a virus from a suspicious email were taken over and simultaneously attacked the targeted company's web server. As a result, the company website went down. This is a typical DDoS attack. Incidents such as phishing scams, targeted email attacks, and DDoS attacks are on the increase worldwide. And recently, tactics have become more sophisticated, such as creating emails with contents only an in-group would know about within an organization. So, don't open attachments or URLs in unfamiliar emails. Install antivirus software and keep it up to date. Be diligent about updating not only your OS, but your application software too. And if you're concerned about anything, ask for advice immediately. These are the kinds of information security measures we need to take. She has her ID and password stuck on the screen of her computer. Great. I've got her ID and password. What? 500,000 yen for girls? I never bought all these. If your password and other information is stolen, you may receive bills for purchases you don't remember making or huge volumes of spam. In the worst case, confidential corporate information may be leaked. Take note of the following points to avoid this scenario. Guard your ID and password carefully to prevent theft. Don't use passwords such as birth dates, etc. that are easy to guess. Make your passwords as long as possible and use a mix of letters, numbers, and symbols. Change your passwords regularly. And don't enter passwords or credit card details into shared computers in places such as internet cafes. The computer is scary. I'm just going to use my smartphone. Whoa! Oh, wait a minute! You need to think of a smartphone as a computer, not a phone. You need to use security measures just like a computer. Right! The internet connects the whole world and will continue to make our lives more and more convenient. What do we need to do to ensure it is safe and secure? People the world over who use the internet have to be careful about information security. Exactly! Just as we take care of ourselves to avoid catching cold or fasten our seatbelts when we go out in the car, we can use the internet with confidence if we adopt proper information security measures. First of all, handle important personal information with care. Next, do not access suspicious websites or unfamiliar emails. And it's crucial to keep your security software up to date. Right? So, be vigilant about information security and enjoy using